Between 1910 and 1915, a young carne wrestler from Nakusa, Wisconsin, born Robert Julius Friedrich, toured Europe, calling himself Ed Strangler Lewis. The nickname came from the sleeper hold he used on opponents. The sleeper was illegal in the United States because it closed off the carotid artery, shutting off the blood supply to the brain and putting the victim to sleep. When Lewis performed the hold in Paris, the crowd thought he was strangling his opponent. He was dubbed in the press Le Strangleur. In 1915, the Strangler came home an established international star. Ed Strangler Lewis was, uh, in my opinion, without question, the greatest wrestler of all time. Lewis's reputation as a dangerous hooker preceded him from Europe. Ed Lewis was the best, period. Ed Lewis could beat anybody at about any given time in about any length he wanted.